God is calling Emmanuel Baptist Church to practice the radical, compassionate discipleship taught by Jesus Christ. As we reflect on the past year, can we find evidence that our community of faith is practicing this kind of discipleship? Jesus taught his disciples to feed the hungry, to welcome the stranger, to clothe the naked, to care for the sick, to visit prisoners. During the past year, we have fed the hungry through our partnership with Luke 1412, serving lunch downtown once a month, and sponsoring food drives in the fall and in the spring. Last winter, we provided food, shelter, and clothing for our homeless neighbors once a month through our partnership with Room in the Inn. This winter, we are doubling our commitment. For the 21st consecutive year on Thanksgiving Day, we raised money to support Nashville's homeless community through the Boulevard Bolt, a collaborative partnership with the Temple and St. George's Episcopal Church. Through our partnership with World Relief Nashville, we welcome strangers from our distant lands in our conversational English classes and help Nashville celebrate World Refugee Day. During monthly visits with the patients at National Community Care and Rehabilitation Center in Bordeaux, through countless hospital visits and time spent with our homebound friends, we have shown compassion to the sick and lonely. By leading worship each month at the next door, we shared the good news with prisoners, women who are striving to break free from generational cycles of addiction and poverty. We helped needy families celebrate Christmas through generous donations of toys and clothing to the Nashville Baptist Association Toy Store and the Nurses for Newborns Angel Tree. On a spring Saturday, we served the least of these in our community and in our congregation through Operation Inasmuch, an annual Emmanuel tradition. For the sixth straight year, a mission team from Emmanuel partnered with Appalachian Outreach to serve the least of these in East Tennessee. During the past year, 134 individuals from our community of faith have been engaged in ministry projects sponsored by Emmanuel Baptist Church, from preschoolers to senior adults. We are grateful to God for his work in us and through us during the past year. Our community of faith has grown closer to God and closer to one another. We are also grateful to God for our ministry partners who provide us with opportunities to share the good news of Jesus Christ, to deepen our love for God and others, to fully engage our neighbor, and to wholeheartedly serve those on the margins of society. We are grateful to God for giving us a vision, for giving us a mission, for giving us partners, and for giving us resources. What will the coming year hold? How will God work in us and through us? Only time will tell. But with grateful hearts as a community of faith, we will strive to be worthy of the calling we have received. Whatever we do, whether in word or deed, we will do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through